2024 March Cheesesteak Madness. Sweet 16. Holy mackerel. Undisclosed location. Oh, look at that. You, this, oh, that's a nice picture. Oh, that's a great picture. I got, I got everything except the bottle of wine. Steaks. Westchester. Too bad about the old guys in the background. Yeah, really versus... <laughs> Ooh, it was too old for him. <laughs> Versus Delco Steaks. <laughs> Everybody knows who you two are. <laughs> Favorite judges. Welcome back. David Phil. Together again. Uh, I'm going to go Delco first because I loved the Delco cheesesteak. I thought it was outstanding. Uh, I, I like the steaks as well. Don't get me wrong. I like them both. They were both... Um, an exploration because I tasted the mushrooms and the uh, onions and the cheese, but I had to I had to open it up. I had to get in, into it a little bit. And Jim was kind enough to, to talk about how the mushrooms in uh, the Delco steaks was kind of chopped up and in there because I tasted them, but I didn't really see them. And um, I thought they were both outstanding. Uh, I'm here wait, for you. I'm here for you. I know. I'm like Phil. Wait, you know, I, I need somebody to. You need somebody in your corner to talk crowd. Probe in there and, and get it done for me. Uh, I'm going to. Uh, I'm going to give the nod to uh, Delco. Wow! Really? I am. Yeah. This this was a this was a close game. It had gone down to the last minute if it were a basketball game. These were two terrific uh, cheesesteaks, no, no question about it. I, I give the nod slightly to Steaks of, of Westchester, which I just thought had a fantastic gestalt. Um, you know, it, it did that, you know, the cheese was really good on both of them. The roll on state, uh, Steaks of Westchester was really, like, bitey. Um, and I just, you know, overall, I, I thought it just... Hit, hit it out of the park. Delco Steaks was right, right, right behind them. But uh, this, this is like a, a tough one to judge. But I'll go with uh, I'll go with Steaks in Westchester by I, by a hair. I I don't I can't I can't fault I cannot fault Phil. And I'll I'll just say that this is one of the reasons why nobody's ever filled out a complete bracket. <laughs> right. I cannot fault Phil. <laughs> Dave, you ignorant slut! <laughs> Damn you! So man. you guys, you guys are, you guys are with you. You're split decisions again. We're so basically, I could have saved my whole freaking night. Just got the four cheese steaks, eating myself, and touching myself. You could have done this all. Wow, could have done all I would have been on both games. I would have. I would have been. You could have stayed in the comfort of your home. And I'd, done be in, this. I'd be asleep already. I'd be all. <laughs> I'd be all comfy. All cuddled up in bed, but no. Right. But you wouldn't have this. This tension. I got it. So I have to think for a minute about these two, huh? And you know what? You're right. It's very close. And it, and it comes down to the role for me. Actually, it comes down to a couple of things. I think I was, I was shocked how well the Delco steak, I, I, how well it ate. Yeah. When, I, when you bite that thing, it really, I think your Dave's first expression was, oh, welcome back to Delco. Um, I think steak's roll would have been a little tougher to eat uh, if we had it earlier in the night. I'm talking. Excuse me. I'm talking. I'm talking here. This is my dog part. And uh, I think Delco sticks was easier to eat. I'm going with Delco. Wow. 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 Why wow from you? You said you like Delco. No, no. I'm liking it. I, I like that you. Back, <laughs> He's not used to people agreeing with him. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm confused. You never get set the family. More wine. More wine, <laughs> sir. Sir, can I have more wine, please, sir? <laughs> All right.